There's a spooky history about UGA that most people are unaware of. Ghosts and spirits linger in the buildings where most students have class every day. Past students, professors, and Confederate soldiers once called the hills of UGA's campus home, and some still do. These stories and more are brought to you by UGA's Student Alumni Association. Every year, students and residents of Athens gather at the Arch to take a tour of North Campus and hear some stories that will make their hairs on the back of their necks stand up. Julie Cheney, Associate Director of the Alumni Association, says that the stories are so good because they all take places in buildings we roam daily. And her favorite ghost story? Mine would probably be Joe Brown Hall, only because it's a story that everybody, everybody sees that building and everybody um, passes by it and you never, you just wouldn't expect. The tours are given on two nights the week before fall break to really get people in the mood for Halloween. You no, know, it's a good time just for people to come out and just, just take a break from studying and, you know, live the spirits before Halloween starts and everything like that. So. Tours are free, but they do encourage you to bring canned goods for local charities. This year's charity is the Northeast Georgia Food Bank. So the next time you're taking a literature class in Joe Brown Hall, or you stop by the Demosthenian Hall to hear a debate, be aware. The spirits from Ghost Pass may be right there with you. In Athens, Georgia, I'm Naomi Clemens for Online Athens.